I have never seen any leader who has won the game of pleasing maximum number of people. Leadership is not about just pleasing people. A lot of people think that, you know, it's all about pleasing people. No, I don't. I have never seen any leader who has won the game of pleasing maximum number of people. Leadership is a combination of compassion and courage. You need to have the courage and also you need to be compassionate about people. Courage to take strong decisions. Courage to, you know, put your vision uh, forward and lead people, you know, take the people along. And you need to have the compassion to understand the people who are there, there along with you. Now, if you are highly courageous and you, don't, you are lacking compassion, you will become more arrogant. You cannot be a leader. You will become more arrogant, you will be more selfish and you, you, you think that, you know, uh, it's all about you. And if you have high compassion and low courage, you will be just trying to please people and you can never lead people. You can never take anybody to a destination. And there are some people who have got low compassion and low courage. They cannot even dream of leadership. Because low compassion and low courage means it's like an apathy. It's more of, a, you know, you're frustrated about yourself, you're frustrated about the world, you're frustrated about everybody. And the ideal situation is a high courage and high compassion. Where you have the high courage to take the firm decisions and move in the right direction. And highly compassionate about people. You ha you are empathetic towards people, you, you understand other people's feelings and you are taking them along. So a high courage, high compassion is what is required for true leadership.